it feels amazing to be a winner um, and to just represent the university on such a big scale to the wide audience. I've come a long way <laughs> from my initial school heats and I'd like to thank everybody who's given me tips and advice and all my friends for supporting me and yeah, oh, it feels good to be the three minute thesis winner. So the basic idea was to get the gist of what your PhD is, what's the core of your PhD and how will you explain it to your grandmother in basic sense if you want to. Every good research idea has to have a story behind it and you want to present it to the audience who would take it up as a story. It's much more easier uh, to communicate anything that way. So I added this uh, climbing up a mountain and the breathlessness that you feel during the hike to how a cystic fibrosis patient feel and that's exactly it. It's the CF patients find it difficult to breathe. What is the solution? What is the next best thing apart from the current medication that would give them a tiny bit of relief, it's gene therapy. I want it to be a small part of telling that story to this big world that there is this disease where, you know, people suffer and they're, you know, we, we are trying our best as researchers. I came into the competition to meet a lot of people. I mean, I wanted to tell my story, my the story of my PhD to the whole world. But I also wanted to meet a lot of people, meet a lot of friends, meet all the other PhD students in the university and this Three Minute Theses gave me exactly that opportunity to mingle, to make friends, to know what people are doing out there and also to tell your story to, to, to a wide audience.